We've had some cool camos recently within Black Ops 3, whether that be via community contracts or supply drops, but we've gotten things like the Dragon Fire, the Into the Void, the Cosmic Camos, and those are all well and awesome, but what if I told you we might have more coming on the horizon? Today we're going to be taking a look at seven secret and hidden camos within the recent game files and game code for Black Ops 3. They're in the build right now and they're just not accessible at the very moment. So firstly, before we get too far into it, if you guys enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like down below. If you guys want to check out my channel, that link is down there in the description below. I'm on that road to 80,000 subscribers, so it helps me out greatly, but of course is completely optional, but greatly appreciated. So jumping right into these firstly credit where credit is due reddit user and youtuber naywin ended up digging up these files and applying them on the pc version of black ops 3 to various different weapons showcasing them both in the create a class menu as well as in-game footage too with this he did an awesome job of applying these here and giving us a visual representation of these so make sure you go check him out his links will be down there in the description below but as for the names for these well there's no official names just yet none of the code designated any such other than one specific one entitled overgrowth but the others he named himself which they're pretty cool camo names but once again probably won't be official if these ever come out those being rock Rage Quit, Eternal, Ethereal, Galaxy, and Placeholder 133. In the background, we'll be seeing some of the footage here of all these different camos, and one thing you can pretty much take away is a lot of these do end up being Pack-a-Punch camos from Zombies, which perhaps leads me to believe that the way trends have been going, maybe this is leading to even more community contracts, giving even more incentive to play Black Ops 3 continuously and to try and grind it out a little bit further, and I'm totally cool with that. We got a couple ones that are left over and different variations from Pack-a-Punch camos with Revelations. We have one overgrowth being from Zetsubonoshima, one looking like a different variation of the Origins Pack-a-Punch camo, that being very similar to the Ice camo, and one that just has nothing to do with zombies at all. So a lot of these are super cool. I really enjoy the look of them, and I think that definitely if we end up getting more community contracts, this is perhaps the way to go. I'd love to maybe see a little bit more of a reward, like maybe a triple play for a community contract, but right now, I'm in love with getting these free camos because it's free content, firstly, I'm a huge fan of the camos, and of course the Zombies camos, to me the Pack-a-Punch camos, always end up turning out incredibly beautifully. I think that they are some of the best camos, if not the best camos in Black Ops 3, and I additionally think the community contract system is a great way to distribute these out to players, whether they want to end up grinding for the camo or there's somebody that is a little bit more laissez-faire and doesn't necessarily go all that hard on the game, but would love to get the camo in time. I think it's a great way to distribute it here for that. And once again, with these being in the game files right now, this isn't something that's been data mined and laid dormant for months on end. This is something relatively new. It's definitely possible that these are upcoming and future community contract rewards. Perhaps they are going to be distributed in a different form and medium. Perhaps it's not going to be community contracts, but regardless, that still does not negate the fact that these are new additions in the game code as of recently. Once again, they haven't been there since the launch or a couple of months back. There were a bunch of different variations of air quote dark matter at the launch of Black Ops 3 that eventually were just different color schemes for, I believe, the Zetsubo Pack-a-Punch camo. Those were around for quite some time, but all these ones are relatively new, once again, being in the game code as of recently. So these are something that have been added there post-launch, post-DLC content season, and are there for a reason. So I'm definitely looking forward to seeing these here coming up in the near future. Once again, hopefully community contract, because we can bang those out as a community in a couple of days time, get some free camos out of it. Perhaps this is gonna be a weekly thing in which we get a new one every single week after we complete it. I think that'd be cool, but I guess we'll see in time. But regardless, I wanna let you guys see all these for yourselves because hidden camos, secret camos, and things coming up on the horizon more than likely are definitely something that I love to share with you guys. So that said, once again, huge, huge shout out to Naywin. Make sure you go check him out. His links will be down there in the description below. He's the one that found these, applied them to the weapons on the PC and gave us some footage here for this. Huge thank you and credit to him. But let me know what you guys think down there in the comment section down below. Are you guys a fan of how these look? Do you guys not necessarily think they look the greatest or do you hope they come in a community contract? Whatever it may be, feel free to drop your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. But if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like down below. If you guys wanna check out my channel, once again, that link is down there in the description below. All completely optional, but does help me out on that road to 80,000 subscribers and is greatly appreciated. But if you guys are also new to Carnage, make sure you guys subscribe here so you don't miss a beat with anything we have here regarding gameplays, cool series, information like this, all that good stuff. We got you covered here up on the channel.
And after all that, I just hope you guys have a fantastic day. But thank you dudes so much for watching. My name's been Espresso. Take care and peace.